technology has emerged. The microchip designed by the Avanti Corporation. But that chip has the power to change the world. You are the future of mankind, Mr. Turner. It would be nice if I had the choice. We're gonna change the plans. Turner's escaped with the chip. chip. The world is in chaos. It's in desperate need of a savior. I intend to be that savior. Body's not gonna stop coming after me. I just know there are a lot of people who want this chip. We should go. All those people disappearing. If that was the rapture, then this chip has a whole new meaning. And I'm not gonna let it fall into the wrong hands. I want you to bring it to me. Confusion is unfolding at this hour as reports are flooding in from around the world. Tens of thousands of people are missing. Many of them are children and without explanation. Adding to the chaos, a rash of extreme natural disasters has blanketed areas around the world. Reports of tsunamis, earthquakes, and violent storms have struck every continent. Governments and scientists have offered no concrete answers, and officials are racing to calm public fears in an attempt to avoid widespread panic. Martial law has been enacted, and authorities are urging citizens to stay indoors and obey all curfews. Thousands have already been seen looting businesses and grocery stores, and internet reports are pouring in detailing the mayhem. Amidst the crisis, the biotech giant Avanti Corporation has been forced to shut down indefinitely due to the disappearance of CEO Dan Cooper. The company has had trouble in recent weeks recovering from a series of violent attacks targeting their research facilities and crippling productivity. Earlier this month, Avanti hinted at a revolutionary new device planned to debut at the G20 summit. But for now, it seems that will remain a mystery. Mr. Turk, they're evacuating the building. Your car is downstairs. Just heard about Avanti. I know. Tragic. No, Miranda. Tragic is financing an attack on their facility assured by everyone it can fail and it fails. Tragic is hearing this vital piece of technology that continues to elude us is now on a plane trapped in a sky 30,000 feet. It has nowhere to run and somehow it slips away. We are doing everything possible to break the encryption on the data confiscated from Avanti, but there is no guarantee we'll be ready on time. The best option, our only option, the chip in Chad Turner. We should consider postponing this trip until we have something more certain. Turner's location, a lead, anything. If we fail to seize this opportunity, someone else will. 
If we fail to locate that ship, it's over, Philip. <laughs> Following keys! Now! You don't want to do this. Your money and your car! It's okay. It's okay. Don't make me kill you, man. You're desperate. I understand. You're not alone. There are millions of men just like you, terrified by the uncertainty of what fresh hell tomorrow might bring. We'll do anything to put their souls at ease. Anything to feel safe. What are you doing? Shoot this guy! Please, don't! Shut up! You're not a killer. But he is. This guy, who you met only a few hours ago, convinced you to take one of his guns despite your protest. To defend yourself against the danger of whatever comes next. That empowers you, so you trust him. This man is the real danger as he hides behind an innocent woman for protection. He uses you to do his dirty work and take the bullet meant for him. What? The second you get into the car, he'll put a gun to your head and take your life away. Isn't that right? Max. He doesn't know me. I know you better than you think. Can't you see what he's doing, Zab? You're in control. He's playing you. No. Defend yourself before it's too late. Put it down, man. <laughs> I'm in a shit. Put it down. Put it down. Don't put it down. No. Don't put it down. Drop it. start tracking me. Avani's not gonna stop coming after me. You heard what Cooper said. And then there's Joseph. I just know there are a lot of people who want this chip. Yeah, what? Is this a bad time? Maybe for the rest of the world. But not me, I'm still here. And where's Mr. Turner? We're in the process of tracking him right now. I don't reward failure, Mr. Pike. If Avanti has the chip back, you don't get paid. Is that a threat? I don't bother with such trivial things as threats. I'm a man of action. Yeah, well... I can't predict natural disasters now, can I? There's nothing natural about what's happening, I can assure you. God gives each of us a calling. One worthy of our abilities. My calling is to bring unity to all those who are willing to accept it, and yours is. To bring the sole ingredient to that process, the chip. You do believe in God, don't you? I believe in money. So you better have mine ready, okay? We need to keep moving, Mr. Turk. Warren, there's been a change of plans. Hack into the Avanti mainframe and initiate the tracking extension. That chip inside Turner is the only way we're gonna find him. Put the word out. I want the best team available on this. It's 
Officially this morning, the chaos emanating from Vatican City has reached a critical mass, leaving thousands dead and many more injured. The event that many are calling the end of days has created complete disarray in all major U.S. cities as well. The most devastating impact seems to be focused in the heart of the Bible Belt, where whole towns have gone missing. At the G20 summit in Berlin, billionaire philanthropist Philip Turk is expected to make the opening statement in what could be the most important week in human history. I'm Alyssa Clark with World Network. Where are we going? Well, my parents go to my brother Jeremy's house on this day every year to, I'm gonna try to feel close to him because um, it's actually the anniversary of the day he died. Sorry. So, you realize they might not be there, right? You're a stubborn little bugger, I'll give you that much. We know you developed that chip technology for Avanti, Mr. Cooper. Eventually, you will tell us how to locate Chad Turner. Wait here, I'll get Mr. Pike. <clears throat> the uh, men you asked for are here, sir? Keep an eye on him. So as you know, the target is Chad Turner, ex-US Special Forces, now courier for prototype biometric chip developed by Avanti. My last attempt to recover the chip was thwarted by the most unforeseen of events. Mr. Turner's a dangerous man. He trained like us. He thinks like us. This is not gonna be an easy job. And there's a five million euro reward for the man who brings him to me. Alive. He's useless to me dead. I want you guys to split up. You've each been given a PDA with tracking software. In a few hours, the chip's tracking system will be online, and we'll know exactly where Mr. Turner is. Any questions? And what are you still doing here? Put him in there. What do we got? I still can't hack into the Avanti system. The mainframe is still down. Until I can access the system, the chip won't help us find Chad Turner. Look, I need this chip. Do what you gotta do to find the chip, yeah? Are you sure you saw them leave? Yes, I only saw them leave. Never saw them enter. And you didn't think to call the police? I just lost my wife and 60-year-old son. I couldn't care less for two Farangs squatting in my building. Which way did they go? What's going on? I'm just thinking about my sister. When I was 10, my parents told me I had a little sister coming. During the birth, there were complications. My mother passed away, but she left us with an angel. Her name was Mali. We were more than just sisters. She was my friend. I was her teacher. I was her refuge. She was my hope. She was everything to me. With my mother gone, my father started to grow apart. He didn't care about himself, let alone his young daughters. He was lost. He started to drink, gamble, fight constantly. One day, he was short on cash, so he decided to throw Malik into the pot to cover the bed. 
local triads came and took her away. been looking for her ever since. It all happened in an instant. Late last night, when most were sleeping, some disappeared what seems like all children below a certain age, with no discrimination of race, gender, or class. What's she saying? Her child is missing. It's the age of accountability. Look, see, the basic idea is this, that children were blessed with the grace and mercy of a loving God because they're too young to choose Christ on his terms, so he chooses them on theirs. I mean, what we just experienced, that was the rapture, okay? All those people taken by God, all the children as well, because they don't have to choose until they're at the age of accountability. And look, don't worry, we're gonna find her, okay? Well, you don't understand. I mean, at this stage, I'd rather her be taken. God knows what she had to do to survive. I think I'd prefer it if she was in heaven, or at peace, or somewhere else. Up. All right, all right, we're going, we're going, we're going. Families woke up to nothing but a pile of clothes to where their children should have been. Those who have offered an opinion believe that this was an act of God. This is Cynthia Brown from World News 11. We should all be with our families. What purpose do we possibly serve here? I've seen enough. Come, we're leaving. No one's going anywhere. Take your seats. Why? What do you expect us to do? I expect you to serve those who chose you to represent them. I doubt they picked you who went face terrible crisis with panic and run for the hills. How did we get here? Why is mankind under attack? Is it our abuse of God's creation destroying the planet with war, hate, and sin? Is this the prophecy? The end of our days? Are we now expected to drop to our knees, all of us praying to the heavens, begging for mercy, or will he give us a last chance? If so, we must evolve. We must change our ways. We must find solution to bring order to the world in chaos, to bring harmony and humanity into the community of man. You cannot stop the wrath of God. Have you spoken to God lately? Did he tell you this was his plan? Or 
Have we all become so driven by fear and consequence that it's the only way any of this can make sense? How does any of this make sense anymore? By thinking different. All religions of the world, all books of faith, speak about a day when God restores his kingdom. Since I was a young boy, I had visions of my own destiny, and a day would come for me to stand before you and share my vision of peace, to create a world where Muslims, Jews, Christians, and all faiths could share our common purpose for being put here, sustaining a life as human beings. For such a time like this, to be one world under God. For so long we have been ruled by our individual interests. What's the best for me? How can I win? How can I be better than them? And look where it's gotten us. Now is the time. Now is our opportunity to have me become us, to get them become us. The answer to our prayers is not in the clouds. It is here. What's the status, Warren? Sir, one of our tactical teams was able to recover the parachute Turner and the flight attendant used to escape the plane. Where are they now? So far, the best I've got is a 50-mile radius, sir. That's a pretty big area, Warren. I know, sir. We're working on it. We'll find them. I need information, people. Anything that can get us closer to Chad Turner until his tracker turns back on. Now, you know the drill. Hey. Hello? Hello? What? You got a name? Warren. Maybe I can help you, Warren. <laughs> And just how do you propose to do that? I know things. Things that can make your life a lot easier. Anything you know, we'll find out on our own. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe Turner will be gone by then. So why do you want to help me? Because you can help me. Look, I'm a dead man. Sooner or later, he will kill me. And if you fail him, he will kill you too. You look around yourself, kid. There are things happening you cannot even comprehend. I can help you, big time. Keep the lights off. I don't want to arouse any suspicion. Steps. Dad? must have been called back to the embassy. Um, Chad? What? They used to pray beside the bed together every night.
so smart. I think they're at a better place now. I really hope they'd be here, but I'm glad they're gone. Of course, they're not at the embassy. They're smarter than that. I suppose you checked the stewardess's house too, right? Of course. No one's seen her for days. Don't be shy. Come on in. What do you want? How about a cup of coffee and a smoke? <laughs> what, you don't want me to untie you? Set you free? Oh, I do. But you don't have the authority for that. A cup of coffee and a smoke? You can handle that. In return for what? I give you information that'll help you get closer to Turner. Well, how do I know your information is legit? You don't. But what else are you gonna do? One. He had a brother. Jeremy Turner? Yeah, he died three years ago. What, you think we didn't know that? He lived here. In Bangkok? Well, that wasn't in the records. Why do you think his father requested the transfer here? Oh, by the way, when you get back, I take my coffee black, one sugar, and I don't smoke menthol. I need a vector trace on the residences owned or rented by Jeremy Turner in and around Bangkok. Pack city records, rental properties, everything. Satellite coming down in three, two, one. What do you have, Warren? Before he died, Turner's brother lived in the city. He may have used an alias. We're running cross checks now. could take hours, sir. I don't have hours, kid. I need that chip, okay? Do whatever it takes to find the chip. We'll do our best, sir. See what's going on out there. The euro practically without value and the US dollar expected to follow. Most anticipate widespread panic on Wall Street and Main Street. At the G20 summit in Berlin, world leaders have assembled in an unprecedented show of unity. Amidst the rising tide of global chaos and confusion, billionaire Philip Turk has emerged as the voice of reason, giving a speech some are comparing to Roosevelt's inspirational address during the Great Depression. Our role. And our responsibility here at the Global Summit is to bring together all participating economies to ensure a strong, stabilized global market, to ensure faith that we're all in know. this together. But the change. Why don't you uh, get cleaned up real quick and then meet me downstairs, okay? To be selfish at a time like this and not take care of our old people, great and small, rich and poor, free and imprisoned.
got a utility bill under the name of Jeremy Turner. Anybody got a location yet? Got it. East side of the town by the river. Great. Who's in the area? Ash. Sending them the coordinates right now. Cash is warned. They're in a house three miles from you. Address incoming. Do you copy? Copy that. On my way. Perfect. Hear that, Joseph? Got it. We're 20 minutes out. Step on it. if you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead you will be saved for it is with your heart that you believe and are justified and it is with your mouth that you confess and are saved never a true believer before all of this happened, but there is no doubt in my mind now. God, please help find Chad's heart. I know he please. He's just being misguided. And God, please, please help me find my sister and take that chip out of Chad's wrist. that you are real and believe in you with all my heart. And I ask you, Jesus, to be the Lord of my life and forgive all that I've done. What is that? I don't know, some money, cell phone. I don't know, I'll have to uh, figure it out later. You look 
nice in my mom's clothes. It's a really pretty color on you. You think she'd mind? No, I think she'd be happier with me. Ready? to show the path, to lead the blind out of darkness, and the future of life for all mankind. No more falling nations. Together we are strong and wise. Together we are one. Chad, we can't stay here. They're checking our every move. This is my father's handwriting. What is he doing with these photos? And chips? Something like this is in your arm? Well, this is a much earlier version. The one that to me is, is much smaller and it's, it's biometric. What does that mean? That means that it's, it's actually alive. It actually lives on my blood. So what's the advantage of the biometric one over these battery powered ones? Well, with the battery powered ones, you can still steal them. All you gotta do is cut them out of somebody. With the biometric one, you, you can't steal them because if you cut them out, the chip dies and the subject dies. Yeah. I have no idea what my father was doing with this. He didn't even believe in the chip program. Well, we know he was a good man, so whatever he was up to, it shouldn't be something you're afraid of finding out about. Well, I hope not. Come on, Chad. Do you honestly think that God would have taken him if he wasn't truly a good person at heart? Dow, you're a good person and God didn't take you. Well, okay, we've established that being good isn't enough. Yeah, never is. You need to start showing me your worth. Find me a way to get this guy and do it now. let you walk out of here. Not yet, no. But a window will come. <laughs> what window? A window of opportunity. Well, you can untie me and I can disappear. You should disappear too, by the way. Nobody disappears from Joseph Pike. <laughs> Tell that to Chad Turner. Obviously, since your dad has all these prototypes, he's somehow involved. What does it say in there? It's mostly names, dates. And then you got the pictures of these girls. Some of them have these numbers stamped on them. And then here in the notebook, it's the same numbers with girls' names next to them. Let me see that. Why would your dad have pictures and lists of girls who've been sold into slavery? No idea. Here's his cell phone. Here's the last message he sent. It says, Dr. Sierra, what do you play Macrook? What is Macrook? Macrook. That's Thai chess. Check his phone book. Here it is, Dr. S. Hey, wait a minute. Dr. S is the name of the doctor who ran the Avanti chip research program. 
you sure? Yeah, it's got to be the same guy. I used to take chips to him once a month to test on animals, right? I never met him, but if he's the one doing the implants, then maybe he knows how to get this thing out of me without killing me. There's a doctor here in Bangkok. He headed the chip development program for Avante, Dr. Sirawat. If I was Chad, I'd be looking for a way to block that tracking device in the chip, since he knows that's our best way of finding him. Well, what would he be doing with all these young girls? Those numbers. They're like mine. Like your what? My, my number. The number that's associated with my chip. But what, what does that mean? I, I think it means that they weren't testing these chips on animals. They were testing them on these girls. But you said that you're the first successful human recipient. <sighs> Warren. Did you find him? Okay, text him. Because if he knows how to get that thing out of you, we're going to have to find him. All right, I can't wait around for... Just came back, Pal Square, 12 o'clock. Pal Square, that's... That's like 20 minutes from here. Come on, let's go. What? Oh, this is Molly. Your sister? Mr. Pike, I have a hit on a cell phone registered in Chad Turner's father's name. Tracking now. Oh, my God. Look, we'll find her. Run a trace. Give me their exact location. Triangulating his current position. Got it. He's in the warehouse district. The text came from a Bangkok number, Dr. Archun Sirawat. Jackson, it's warned. They're in a warehouse by the waterfront. I'm sending you the address now. OK. I'm on it. Jackson is at the warehouse. Jackson, what do you got? I got nothing here, guys. Talk to me. OK, given the time since the text that they were running, and approximately, got it. You've got a six block radius at most. All right, I'm on it. Look, I think that's where the muckbook tables are. Look, since they're tracking me, why don't you wait over by the park benches? Be careful. I will. Dr. Sirawat? Dr. Sirawat? Excuse me. Now. Excuse me. I got Turner. 
Right on top of them. Get to the south end of the park. Okay. Okay. There. Down there. Pull over there. Can't you get this guy to go any faster? Well, I think the only way to get him to go faster is to pay him. Chad? Yes, there it is. We're finally into Avanti's server. What are all those red dots? There should be one green dot. That's Chad. Any of the other red dots are older models of the chip. I don't know why they're there. I don't care. Where is this? By the river near the water market. Just send these coordinates to my PDA. at the forty market. Stay on them. I'm almost there.
You had a good run, Chad, but it's over. I don't want to kill you. Don't worry, mate. You won't. What? You're testing my patience. Join the club. I didn't come this far to have someone like you by my downfall. Yeah? Well, then you shouldn't have hired me, should you? No more warnings, Mr. Pike. If you don't deliver Chad Turner to me alive, things will become very unpleasant for you. I promise. The pain you're feeling in your arm right now, that burning anguish torturing your body and mind, will soon inhabit your soul and punish you for eternity. Your lungs will bleed from crying out for mercy, but none will come. You'll know nothing beyond endless grief and agony. Don't push me, Mr. Pike. I can be a real beast. What are we doing? I've got to look something up. This isn't the first time my father's been involved with dangerous people. Whenever he had to go into hiding or keep something safe, he always gave the location a name. Okay. It's something that just the family would understand. <sighs> Victory. You think the doctor's going to be there? Well, let's hope so. But how do we know we can trust him? I mean, maybe he set us up. One day after the world-changing events, the wait continues for families of the missing. Those seeking answers have found none, only adding to the civil unrest sweeping across the globe. Reports of widespread rioting has increased the pressure on political, business, and religious leaders who are at the United Nations this afternoon, rallying behind entrepreneur Philip Turk, the man who has become the unifying figure in this time of disaster. Philip Turk's proposed identification system is being hailed as the answer to the crisis, a way to unite the nations of the world and protect citizens from another event. Opponents to this human tracking system are losing their voice as the public's demand for action grows louder. They're not gonna stop coming after us. What are you doing? Maybe if I can cut off the blood supply to the chip and block that tracking device. What the? Crap. It's gone. The chip? Yeah. I told you he's smart. Your boss won't be happy. I don't think it's much further. Are you OK? to raise poison in my system. Oh, wait. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to get you to the doctor now. Huh? Let's get you to the doctor. He can help us. Come on. Come on, Chad. Just hang in there, please. Just a little bit Make sure you keep the gun on him. All right. Dr. Sirawat? Dr. Sirawat? Dr. Sirawat? Hey, 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 what are you doing? Whoa. Doctor, I'm Chad Turner. 
You worked with my father. Look, he has a chip in him, okay? We need you to remove it. I think the poison's already been released. You should have said that sooner. Let's get him in before someone sees. Is he still with Avanti? Well, if he was, we wouldn't be here. How did you find me? Track the last text you sent us? I thought I was meeting his father. I've been changing my location so much, I need him to know my current one. Well, well his father's... His father's missing? Look, wait. How do I know you're not going to kill him? You don't. You just have to have a little faith. You look worried. You can't even see my face. How come you don't seem to be worried? <laughs> Haven't been punched in the face for a while. You're right to be worried, though. About Pike? God, Warren. You should be worried about God. I know I am. And we're going live in three, two, one. In this time of great tragedy, we must join together as one heart and one soul and follow one belief system. Only Phil Turk has shown the qualities necessary of leadership. The Mark technology is proof. He's committed to securing the world's best interests. Mr. Turk, is this a mandatory program you're intending to enforce? The chip will be implanted by choice and absolute free will. But when the benefits become clear and appreciated, the world will follow. Together, we will prevail under one gracious leader, under the revolutionary social justice of the Mark. The world has been hit with a catastrophe never before seen by mankind. That is why we are in support of Mr. Philip Turk. Ich bin davon überzeugt, dass wir einen Mann wie Philip Turk jetzt mehr denn je brauchen. A Philip Turk, a tout non possible man, visabene. I am merely a figurehead, and I'm grateful the world sees the needs for unification in these troubling times, and that they see the qualities necessary for leadership. In me. World leaders are assembling inside the United Nations at this hour, expected to take part in a historic vote that will assure global unification during this unprecedented time. New technology advocate Philip Turk will be sworn in as international chairman and the implementation of his ID program, known as the Mark, will begin. In the wake of the disappearances that some believe have extraterrestrial origin, while others claim the Bible predicted its occurrence, leaders from around the world are calling all nations to join together to form a singular global community that some are referring to as a new world order. Crazy times. I removed most of the poison already. He should be out for another hour or so. Will you brush him up just in case? First time student. But it's not just in case I know what I saw. What's that? Well, this is the device that blocks the GPS signals coming in from the chip. You can't take it out? It's the best we can do right now. Lucky Avanti had me develop these at the same time as the chip. They knew there'd be a call for them on the black market. Some people didn't want others to know where they were at all times. Especially their wives. And so, the other test subjects before Chad? 
they all died. You think this was the rapture? What do you know about the Bible, Warren? Sunday school, movies, internet stuff. I'm a science major. I believe in evolution. What do you know about the Bible? There's not much I don't know, Warren. You think it's caused by aliens, though, don't you? <laughs> Scientifically speaking, yes. But proof in the existence of God would be fun. Scientifically speaking. Of course. What about personally? That too. Where did you get them? We found them in the safe belonging to Chad's father. Yeah, I was collecting evidence against Avanti for him, okay? We were trying to build a case to bring them down. I gave him those photos. Okay. Do you remember this girl? I remember them all. Okay, wait. This girl, her name is Malik. She's my sister. Hey, you know what? This girl was never implanted. She's alive as far as I'm concerned. Did you know where? No, nah, I'm sorry. But they never told us where they kept the girl. Mr. Turner, I'm Dr. Siriwan. Your friend here has been filling me in. It's an honor to finally meet you. So you did a background check on the flight attendant, right? Stewardess? Of course. No family left, never been married, lives alone, and we've already checked her address. No family left? None? Chad, if this was rapture, so it's the beginning of the seven years, right? Yeah those of us who are left here on Earth are going to suffer the worst trials and tribulations ever known to mankind. And everyone will be judged, and only those who choose to believe will receive the grace of God. Okay, so if this is the beginning of those seven years, isn't the Antichrist supposed to rise to power? That's right. Sorry. I didn't mean to overhear. Chad. Your father always spoke about this. He knew that this day would come. He was afraid that the people would forget to be conscious of the man with the silver tongue. The man who could do no wrong. Yeah, the man who people would follow into a burning fire and destroy themselves. The Antichrist. And this chip is what he's going to be after. Because if he gets a hold of this thing, he can control, control everyone. He can control the world. Wait a minute. I know how to find your sister. Warren, if the world are going to hell in a handbasket and the only person you related to was still out there, wouldn't you try to find them? There are three buildings right here, owned by the same white tire. Okay. And I'll bet you anything that the girls are in one of those buildings. All right. Can you get us there? So Turner is with her. Either they find the sister, and that's where we'll find them. Or we find the sister first, and use her as a bargaining chip to bring him in. It's a win either way. <laughs> See some girls. Here, you look, see if you can recognize Molly. Uh, no, I don't see. Oh, wait a minute. 
Jack, that's Malay. We go with Scott. I see her. Are you sure that's her? With all my heart. How many girls are there? That's what I was thinking. We're gonna have to get them all out of there. I hacked into police records. The father's in the system for theft, assault, illegal gambling. He lost a lot of money to the triads in a gambling spree. How does that help us? The San Juan triad's known for taking all different forms of payment. They'll take property, livestock, people. What's eating you? People. Yeah, people, prostitution. Oldest known profession in the world? No, Warren, it's not prostitution. What's going on? What do you know about the Avanti chip program? Hey, Jack, you got a boat on the docks. As long as we get the girls here, I get to safety. All right. What's the plan to get the girls out there? Well, I'm going in alone. Oh, no. I'm coming with you. Doubt. It, it's too dangerous. Please. She's my sister. All right. All right, doctor. Be ready to move. OK. Good luck, guys. Let's do it. Please. No. We're going in to rescue your sister, OK? They're not going to just let us walk in there and get hurt in the other without a fight. Any other option, you know I'd take it, don't you? OK, we can do this, OK? okay. Wait, wait. Dear God, guide us through the path against our enemies. And how is to fulfill the calling which you have received? Come on, come on, come on. 
What? What is it? What is it? Th there's another girl. We can't leave without her. Where is she? She's downstairs. She's serving the guards while they're playing cards. Okay, look. Let's just get the girls down into the van. I'll come back for the other girl. Okay, we gotta go. Let's go. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. Hold that back, hold that back. Shh, come on, you can't, you can't. Shh. Warren, the window of opportunity, it's here. The sister's the final piece. If Chad gets away, I got nothing left. If Pike gets him, it's over anyway. Then he'll let you go. Do you really believe that? Just uncuff me and walk away. I'll handle the rest myself. I can't do that. I mean, he'll know it was me. If Chad gets away, he'll kill us both. Uncuff me and get the hell out of here. You know what you are, Warren. What am I, sir? You are worthless. You are completely worthless to me. What are you doing here? I wanted to talk to you about Mr. Cooper. Sir, about his uh, involvement today. His involvement. Because of him that we were able to locate Chad Turner, sir. It's because of him that I was shot. Look, I admire your courage, kid. So I'm gonna give you a lesson. A lesson that might save your life. I always believed the work I was doing with Avante on the chip was for the greater good. It's okay, come on. Life sacrifice were for the benefit of mankind. I was wrong. And if I'm to believe that you and all the other whack jobs when you talk about this rapture event. And personally, I think it's a great situation to make myself a very rich man. It is easier for a camel to go through the eye of a needle than a rich man to enter the kingdom of God. Matthew, 
Everything okay? Did you get the last girl? Chad. Look, I think you did everything you could, okay? Yeah. Chad. We need you. Okay, I'll be there. Tracker's back on. Mr. Pike! What is it? His chip just came back on. He's headed for the docks. Night, Kai. Get the guns. Call Jackson. Get him over there. Don't lose that signal. I won't lose the signal, sir. Good lad. If you have families, go to them. Just get out of here. And don't come back. Great job, by the way. What do you know about the Bible? Proof in the existence of God would be fun.
She is. She's old, but she'll get us where we need to go. Come on. Okay. Ah, Tam, Tam, he's going to be more than My safe house is only ten kilometers from here down river. to run you know Chad it's marks like you that make my job so enjoyable the basic nature of human beings is to be weak most of them won't even put up a good fight even when they're threatened but you you put up one heck of a fight this I'm going to enjoy. What's wrong, mate? I saw you take out a unit of elite men. Expected more from you. It's too bad the poison from the chip is working. caring about the chip. I'm gonna kill you, and I'm gonna enjoy it. You can't kill me. I have a higher purpose. <laughs> and I don't think my purpose is to die at your hands. I'm sorry to disappoint you, mate. That's not important, Mr. Trigger. All you need to know is I'm here to make things easier for you in the near future. Thank you. Come on. Oh, Look, 
I can disable Avanti's tracking system. That should buy you enough time to figure out what to do next. How long? Until they build a new mainframe. A few months, a year, maybe more. Why? I'm, I'm hoping it's not too late. Sins of the past and all that. Come on. <laughs> Let's get going. Thank you. Okay. You know they're not going to stop coming after you, right? Don't worry. I'll keep the girls safe. What you did today was extraordinary. Young man. Thank you for everything, Doctor. You're a good man. I hope you realize that. I'll leave you two together. I know what you're up to, Mr. Turk. And there are a lot of people in the business community, job creators, myself included, who aren't just gonna sit back and let it happen. If you nationalize our industries, we will shut you down. That won't be easy. People will fight back. I'm giving them what they want. What about what I want? Tell you what, Mr. Vanderway, lead your industry and all other job creators, as you call them, and I'll make it worth your while. Trust me, you don't want to fight. Let's help one another. Tell me what you want, and I make it happen. So, let me tell you a story. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. And the earth was without form and void. And the darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the spirit of the God moved upon the face of the waters. And God said, let there be light. And there was light. And God saw the light, that it was good. And God divided the light from the darkness. And God called the light day, and the darkness he called the night. Great things can happen when people take a stand against what is wrong and fight back. I'm grateful to have Malik back in my life, free from the horrors of captivity, the perfect ending to a tragic tale. But for us, the story continues. The world around us is descending into darkness. Our journey doesn't end until there is light and goodness for all, under the grace of God. We have elected Philip Turk as our new active chair. Thank you, Mr. Secretary. I'm extremely honored to serve in this time of need. I'd like to express how proud I am to lead our new world into its prominent future. As a leader, I vow to protect the best interests of not only one nation, but of all mankind. We'll rise from this tragedy like a phoenix from the ashes and take flight together. We must seize this opportunity to build something new, something stronger, something better. Today, 
We're setting the course for a new tomorrow. Our new world order.